Okay, this is too big. Why they use it too big? Okay, they probably they use just zero paper, you know. So it's a very very big one. Okay, any question? Oh yeah, yeah. Oh God, so quick. <laughs> Waiting so long, huh? What is? What is it? What is so important? Yes. The, the retribution of the hells. Yeah. I don't understand why the um, the um, judgment was so severe and so long. Yeah. I know that you know a mistake was made, but it was a mis- it was a bad mistake. It was a mistake in one lifetime. Why such a long and severe judgment? It it doesn't seem like the karma that we have to face in this lifetime, like an eye for an eye or mm. life for a life. It, it doesn't seem fair. Why Not fair. That's what I said. That's why the master come down and fish you up quicker. Don't talk to these people. <laughs> Don't talk to these hell people, because they're not fair. It's just not fair. This world is full of unfairness. That's why you should get out. And then we talk <laughs> in a better place <laughs> where we can talk, you know, in all fairness. Yeah? And no judgment. No unfair judgment. It's truly unfair. This is the world like that, terrible world, half hell world, because this is the do- domain of unfairness, of suffering. And if you go in here, that's what you get, okay? Just like if you go in the water, you say, what? I only jump in for two seconds and I'm all wet, just like I'm there for a year. It's not fair. Okay? But if you go in the water, even just one second, you get all wet. It's like that. You stay there another day, you also get the same wetness. Yeah? You also in the water. It's like that. It's not fair. That's why all the Master, the Buddha, encourage people to get out, liberate, aim for liberation. Don't aim for the marriage in heaven. Don't aim for marriage on earth, don't wish to be king or god or, you know, divas, nothing. Just aim for buddhi, enlightenment, buddhahood at the end. See? Uh huh. This is a world like that. Mm. Mm-hmm. Thank you, Master. You're welcome. <laughs> Jum. Uh, yes. We heard uh, these kind of stories uh, a lot uh, when I was small until now, and mm. it's hard to believe this kind of hell is existing. Mm. Or so all these kind of things you're reading is true. True. Is it true? Wow. This is true. Or else I wouldn't read it for you. I waste my time and, and uh, you know hurt my throat. Last night I coughed after reading so much hell. It affected me. You know. Yeah, but I wanted to so that other outside people, or even your people, awaken to some reality of this cruelty of world. It is like that, okay? This is a world of cruelty, negative, and they are treated you like that. They will be treating you like that. Just like you happen to fall into a, a, a group of gangsters or robbers, do they care anything about how you feel, or that's the last penny you have, or the jewelry came from your mother's inheritance? Do they care? No, they rob everything blind, because that's their nature. huh? Mm. And if you go near the fire, then you feel hot. If you jump into fire, then you get burned. That's the nature of fire. So this world nature is like that. They're here to torture you, to rob you of everything blind, or of your intelligence, your right thinking, your belief, anything. They try to destroy it all, so that you come there and they enjoy to torture you. It's the nature of hell. It's the nature of the world. But it is because we are powerful. We are very powerful. Everything we think, everything we do, return to us fivefold. It's also not fair that you just give one penny to the Buddha 
or one dollar, and life after life, you're born with richness and yeah, 91 life. Is it fair? It's not. But everything in this world is like that. You do a little bad thing, you get thousandfold punishment. You do a little good thing, you get millionfold reward. Okay, so just do good thing then. Yeah. Fair or not fair, we cannot change it. This is the nature of this world. We cannot change the nature of fire. So we have to protect ourselves. Don't go near the fire or go there with protective. Huh? Okay? Uh, the nature of water is wet. Don't go near there, don't jump in there, or go with the uh, uh, diver suits. Huh? Okay? And oxygen mask so you don't drown. Don't trust the water, just protect yourself. Don't trust the hell, don't trust this world. Just protect yourself. Yeah, I'm teaching you the way to protect yourself 24 hours a day because there's no other way you can protect yourself except return to goodness, yeah? Rely on the power of all the Buddhas and the past enlightened saints and sages. Their power is still protecting you. But you have to be on their side, okay? That's it. It's uh, very nice to hear it. These kind of things are true because sometimes uh, my uh, friends or other people ask me what I should do if I have uh, such uh, sickness or something like that, and mm. I, I haven't anything to say to them. Mm. So now at least I have something you yeah. can read uh, su such yeah. herb, herb sutra, sutra yeah, or yeah. something like that. Yeah, there so are many other sutra. Yeah. yeah, yes, yes, it is true. Mm. It's true for ordinary people who has nowhere to take refuge. Buddha is not here, they don't find any master, they don't know any other things. So these uh, past sutras are good for them, you know, to some extent. But the merit is just for heaven and earth merit. You see? The path of liberation is with the Kuan Yin method. Gone forever. Don't care about merit or not merit, we're gone to heaven and we don't come back. We can if we want to, but the, by choice is different than being pushed down, you know? Mm. Okay? So even being a god in, in heaven is also should not be desired by us. We just wish for liberation. Yeah. Buddhahood. Yeah? I mean liberation, ultimate. To be a god in heaven, even even Brahman God, you know, the highest of the third world, still go and bow down to Buddha, please teach me. Second God, uh, third God, they all come down and bow to the Buddha, because their time will be gone. Their time will be up. Then they will be going down like us again. Who knows? Maybe one of you was a God in heaven before. Yeah, that's why when you come here, you still have this bearing, you know. Or maybe you look nice, look beautiful, and still have some halo around. You still have this manner of God. But that's not enough. That's not it. That's not it. Because you'll be reborn again and again. God knows where. When your merit runs out, you'll be born like a human or even animals and suffering, ignorance. And then it gets worse if you don't have anyone to guide you, any master to teach you. Then you forget also and you do bad things too. Okay? Even the god Chakra, he does bad things. Came down and taught to the innocent being like that, just to test him. Do you understand? That's not a good thing to do. Huh? It's violent, it's cruelty. God, you know, one of the gods. <laughs> so you know, huh? You know. Only to be in the Buddha's path, I mean enlightenment path, and you cultivate compassion, love, as well as wisdom. To have wisdom alone, to have merit alone is not a one day be gone. You have no heart, like chakra, no heart. The Buddha is already crawling on the on the floor, bleeding, dying, and weak and trembling. Still ask, how can you prove that you are sincere? <laughs> My God, understand? Yeah, no good. The Maya has a lot of power almost like Buddha, but he has no compassion, no love. That's the difference. Huh? Okay? Uh, you tell them recite this if they don't follow me, but tell them also vegetarian diet. Yeah? 
at least many days a month, as many as possible. That's not only good for uh, the world, good for their health. Keep uh, praying for health, as reciting Buddha, and then eating poison, <laughs> then it's uh, cancel out. Yeah? Maybe the Buddha give you health and goodness, and then you go and eat poison, drink, you know, alcohol and stuff, smoking and drug, and then whatever the marriage the Buddha give you is cancel out. It's zero. It become equal. Mm? Or then you have just a little bit, maybe married left. Hi. Yeah. Thank you very much because I, I saw myself in your diary. I know where I'm from when I look back. Yeah. And I can imagine that me and my husband are here. Thank you. You're because you changed our life 360 degrees from the opposite direction. Oh, that's good to hear. So thank you very much. I, I don't know where to start, but my heart is full of love and joy for you. Thank you for pulling us. I'm very pleased. I'm very pleased for myself also to have such a uh, company like you. You know, it's not that we don't sin, it's just that we know and we stop. You see, every saint has a past, <laughs> every sinner has a future. It's not that we, we haven't done anything wrong. Everybody may have done everything wrong, but at least we know, you know. <laughs> it's just you've done wrong because you didn't know anything. You're surrounded by wrong people, by wrong action, by wrong society. You, you don't know what else, you see. but. But you are good inside. That's why when you see something good, you know it right away. Oh, this is, a, this is the thing I want. Not, not this, not this. I throw it out, I throw it out. That is a wise person. It's not like you never make mistake, then you are a wise person. It's not like that. Okay? <laughs> but thank you for saying that. Where's your husband? Yeah, this one. <laughs> How come both of your hair look the same? <laughs> It looks similar here. <laughs> it's a fashion in family. <laughs> I'm so pleased. I'm so pleased that you came. As as much as you're happy to come here to see me, I'm as happy to see you, to receive you, and to know that you turn around. I'm really pleased. <laughs> That's a reward for me, yeah? It's truly, that makes me happy. Thank you anyway. Thank you also, okay? Thank you. <laughs> you don't just thank me, I thank you for coming, yeah? For turning, for knowing, for knowing where you want to go. Because in this world it's so confusing, you know? Nobody teaches no one anything. Mostly it's just negative influence, yeah? Mm. If you're surrounded by smokers uh, all the time, day in, day out, one day you also try one, you know? Just pressure, you know? I said, just try one, it won't die. My God, don't be coward. Try one. And then you try one, and then you try two, and another one, give you another three, and then you're hooked in cigarette, even though you never intended to smoke to begin with. Yeah? Anything, anything, anything. These societies is just contaminating in disguise. Difficult, difficult to swim out of it. Difficult, very difficult. So anyone say that they have done wrong in the past, I never condemn them. I know, I know what makes them like that. It's the influence around, yeah? Like even you have children, you, at home you teach them very well. But outside there, the whole school, <laughs> you know? Children are badly influenced by chance you tell them to smoke, to drink, because it's cool, it's, you know, it's grown up and all that. And then, so even though you try to bring your children in the right path, it's very difficult even to control them, you see? It's like that with all of us. Don't worry, you're beautiful and you're good. You're welcome, you're home. <laughs> I'm so pleased, <laughs> so pleased to see the two chocolate. <laughs> Special for you. <laughs> Very 
it a little shorter, then look exactly like that. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Don't worry. I love you. I love you so much. Something like this is like a reward for me. <laughs> Any other question? Yeah, I'm so pleased. Thank you. <laughs> you have children yet? How many? Three, three, one? Two of them are one Okay. Wow. And you say what? <laughs> You have goodness in you, that's why you recognize good things. Don't blame yourself, forget the past. You have no more past, all gone, erased. Yeah? At the time of initiation, whatever you done wrong in the past is burnt. But whatever you are destined to undergo in this lifetime, you have to bear it. Okay? Ma Master, you are doing a very great thing for us. My family, you are doing very phenomenal things for us for giving us the opportunity to come here. In fact, it's something that I, I don't know how to express it. We love you so much. My children, they told, they told us, when you people go, tell, tell Master that we love, we love her. <sighs> so we are, I'm conf conveying the message from my, my children to you. Tell them also, I, love you. I would love them very much. Thank One day we will have a better place, longer place, bigger. Somehow, someday, I'm dreaming. And then the children can also come running, you know, and have room for to stay, even ten to sleep in, you know, and to be around, but they don't have to meditate a lot, just to be around and to see me and that I can hug them sometimes. And that you can see that they are around, you know, without worrying they're at home doing what, you know. One day we do that, okay? Just for you. Just for us. Because of you. Yeah. I try, okay? In this complicated bureaucracy world, I try. Yeah. I will. I will try. Yeah. I'm, I'm trying. It's just <laughs> have to be suitable. You know, yeah. I don't know. Anywhere is suitable, and everywhere is not. <laughs> Who knows? Yeah. With more merit from your meditation, sincerity, we are right. Because I also didn't think I would come back to see you. You know, at that time it was too much burden. I thought the humans are not really suitable for anything <laughs> spiritual. I thought I, taste, I taught them everything I could already. And then it's up to you to make use of it or not. You see. I shouldn't just be around and uh, always have trouble, but uh, it's okay. I came back and I'm happy. Yeah, see you guys. Yes, yeah. these kind of people make my day, you know, and make me want to do more for you. Mm? Okay, all right. We try. Yeah. Okay. Yes. I'm so sorry that the world is not one country. You know. And that we don't have this magical power like Mao La Ga La Ya Ya <laughs> to fly together in the world. No, he only fly in spiritual body, not not the human body. It's too cold to <laughs> go up there and fly. If they fly there, some people would have shot them already. You know, even in old time, yeah, in broad daylight and fly like that, huh? The, ah! Then some people would die from heart attack, <laughs> and some people might shoot them down, you know, thinking strange bird or some ghost or something, huh? Mm. Yeah, that's why people are still waiting for Jesus to come. How does he come? Flying through from the sky? <laughs> yeah, they shot him down. They will before before he could even open his mouth. <laughs> 